With the one hole paper punch, make two holes just under the lip of the first six ounce plastic cup. The holes should be opposite each other on the cup. Be careful not to tear or break the plastic cup when you pull the punch away from it. Repeat this step for the second plastic cup. Take the string or yarn and measure 10 inches in length using the ruler or tape measure. Cut the string. Repeat these steps. There should now be two pieces of string or yarn, each 10 inches in length. Taking one plastic cup and one piece of string, thread one end of the string through one hole in the cup and tie a knot. Do the same for the second end of the string and second hole in the cup. You may wish to double knot the string so it does not separate from the cup during testing. Repeat this step for the second cup and second piece of string. Take one cup and slide its attached string over one end of the ruler. Move the string to the 1 inch or 11 inch mark, depending on which side you place the cup, and tape it to the ruler. Repeat these steps for the second cup on the other end of the ruler. There should now be one cup hanging from the 1 inch mark and one cup hanging from the 11 inch mark of the ruler. Take the 12 inch cup and flip it upside down. The bottom of the cup is now facing upward. Place the pen or pencil so that it is laying flat and centered across the bottom of the cup. Attach it to the cup in this position using tape. Rest the ruler with attached cups on the pen or pencil, so that the 6 inch mark is centered on the pencil, forming a balance. Cut pieces of aluminum foil, or paper or plastic wrap, into 4 inch by 4 inch squares. Cut one piece for each household glue you want to test. Center one piece of the foil underneath one of the cups now hanging from your balance. Attach this piece of foil to the work area using tape. You may wish to spread the household glue onto the aluminum foil before sliding it under the cup.